Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you from our bathroom because I'm gonna be sharing with you my cloth diaper wash routine. In conjunction with our wash routine, I wanted to share this with you guys. This is the diaper sprayer that I recently got. It is from Perfect Sewn and it is also marketed as a bidet, so you could use it for that. This is not just for cloth diapering parents, but this thing is amazing. I started cloth diapering maybe five months ago or so, and up until last week when I got this, I was washing all of her poopy diapers by hand, which was not a lot of fun. I shouldn't say washing them. I was like rinsing them out by hand. Um, and so having the sprayer has been awesome. I honestly get a fair amount of requests, not like a ton, but I get it. I turn down more requests to review products than I accept. And so I was really kind of surprised with myself when I agreed to do this one because I was looking for a diaper sprayer because I was ready to have one. And the woman who reached out to me and asked if I wanted to try this was so sweet and so nice and so easy to work with. And so I'm gonna be sharing this with you guys. I will leave a link where you can get this down below with a discount, I believe. So it ends up being like less than $30 on Amazon, which I think is wonderful. Anybody could use these. You don't have to be a cloth diaper parent. I think anybody could really enjoy having this. And I'm just gonna be showing you guys how this works. Kate Schwenke recently did a review on this exact same product and I asked her if I could link her video down below because she did a phenomenal job explaining the really detailed um, installation process for this. It's not that it's really difficult, it's just her video is really, really good and informative. So I highly recommend checking out Kate's video, which I will link down below. I will kind of just show you guys briefly how I installed it, but again, hers is way better. So I will just briefly go over how I installed it. It comes with everything you need. You have like the sprayer, you have the T-valve, you have all of the things. I actually only used a screwdriver and that was only to mount the actual sprayer itself. Otherwise, I didn't need any tools for it. Basically, you turn off the water supply to your toilet, you flush all of the water out of the tank, and then you disconnect that valve, connect it to the valve that it comes with, and basically connect the bidet sprayer onto that. It's really, really simple. And the only real thing you have to remember when you're using your sprayer is that you want to turn off the water supply to the sprayer when you're not using it. So whenever I go to use the sprayer, I just flip the switch, and it works, and then I remember to shut it off when I'm done with it. So very, very handy. This thing is awesome. It has phenomenal pressure, which I will show you guys, and it has made the washing process for cloth diapers way better and way less disgusting. <laughs> so basically, I'm just gonna show you guys how I do my wash routine, and so this is what I do with diapers that I need to rinse anything out of, if you know what I mean. So like I said, I start by turning the water supply on to the diaper sprayer. Once it's on, this diaper is clean, but you get the idea. I figured no one would want to see that. I generally remove the insert and I put that in the diaper pail. And then you have your diaper, which has stuff on it. You take your sprayer and I'll just show you in the toilet here. You can push it down just a little bit and you can kind of see there what you're getting for pressure. And then as I push down, It's amazing. Rinses everything off that I need from the diaper. I go ahead and I throw this in the pail as well, and then it is ready to wash. Once all my diapers and inserts are ready to be washed, I take the pail liner and all the diapers and inserts with it, throw it into my washing machine, and I do a rinse cycle with just a small amount of detergent. I just use regular Tide detergent. I find that that's super easy. Tide is an approved detergent for the diapers that I use, so it just is nice to be able to have like a consistent level of <laughs> what I use so I don't have to worry about having a special detergent for my cloth diapers. After the diapers have gone through the rinse cycle with a little bit of detergent, I start them on a actual washing load. So I either do this on like regular or normal or on like super heavy just so it gets a little bit of extra time to agitate around. And when I do the actual wash cycle, I also do the Tide detergent and I do just a little bit more. Then I do some OxyClean. And then every once in a while, I will add a little bit of what's called Calgon to my cycle. I found that helps to reduce some of the buildup in my diapers and it helps them not to retain any of like that residue so they don't tend to leak as badly. I got that tip from my friend Amber because I was asking her, I was telling her that I was struggling with some leaks in my cloth diapers and feeling like they weren't holding what they should even just after an hour they were starting to leak. So she recommended that to me and ever since I've been doing that in a couple of my, like every other or so of my cycles, 
I have found that I don't get the leaks like I used to. My diapers will last for the two to three hours that they're supposed to, and it's been so, so nice. Kind of as a recap, I do a rinse cycle with a little bit of detergent. I do a regular cycle with the detergent, the OxyClean, and occasionally the Calgon. And then I do just a regular dryer routine. I just throw them in the dryer on low heat. Some people don't recommend doing that because it can wear out their elastic. I am willing to sacrifice the longevity of my diapers if it means the convenience of having them in the dryer. I live in Minnesota, so it's not always realistic to put them outside. So in the dryer they go, liner, diapers, inserts, all of it on low heat. And when they're ready to come out, I stuff them and they're ready to use. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them down below. Again, I'm still relatively new to the cloth diapering world, but I will certainly try to answer any questions that you may have. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And again, if you're interested in the cloth diaper sprayer, I highly recommend it. Again, anybody can use this. It's not something that you need to be a cloth diapering parent to benefit from. And for less than $30, it's like, it's just a nice thing to have, even as a bidet. <laughs> like for postpartum reasons and everything else, it's just a nice, nice option to have a diaper sprayer. And I love this one. I love the way it looks and I love the way it functions. No leaks, super easy to install, love it. So I will leave a link down for that below. And I think that is everything. Thank you very much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.